Your Europe, Your Say is an incredible project launched by the European Economic and Social Committee to give the possibility of students from all over Europe to bring their own ideas, their values and to discuss the future of Europe. Well, we are celebrating the European Year of Cultural Heritage and so uh, it came across to our mind that it could be interesting to benefit from the, the fact that uh, we have uh, so many different cultures, so many diverse, but I think we could be united by diversity. For too long, Europe has been built mostly through economy. But really what is the heart and the soul of Europe, it is that culture and cultural heritage. Cultural heritage is like an anchor in time. It tells us where do we come from, what we have inherited from the generations who have been living in Europe on this planet before us, but it also is something that we will be passing on as our legacy to the future generations. Je m'appelle Daphne Pataka, je suis comédienne, j'ai 25 ans. Je suis née ici, à Bruxelles, mais mes deux parents sont grecs. Et euh, pour vous dire la vérité, je ne me sens ni vraiment grecque, ni vraiment belge. Je me sens vraiment européenne. I think that this event is a great initiative. I was very moved to be here today and I felt very honored. I really like it. I feel like it provides us a lot of information and knowledge. I'm learning a lot. The thing I love about this event is that we get to meet so many different people and understand so much uh, about other people's culture. I think it's a really good idea to do these events because you give the people who participate a real sense of Europeanness. We were divided based on our goals for Europe in the future and now we are working on how we concretely want to get to those points. So it's important to raise awareness about what you are going to do, who you are going to meet. If we don't preserve our past, it's going to, you know, disappear and exactly. someday yeah, the just... future generations just don't going to remember it. So who's voting for this one? I chose the topic of safety, but through diversity of uh, traditions. Terrorism arises when we don't like each other, we have hatred towards each other, but if I understand you and you understand me, then I don't think there will be any hatred in the, any place. Because that's what Europe is right you now. Want to say that yeah, there's yeah, 20, okay. 28 governments which will work together at a European level, but not all of, all of them want to. We think that the sense of caring about other people from other countries is really fading away in this world in which nationalism is on the rise. So we're really trying to preserve cultures, not only the own cultures of people from the group, but also other people's cultures. <laughs> We're going to listen to every single one of your groups. The floor is yours. To prevent a negative view of the EU, we want to give a chance of traveling and learning languages to students who don't know about European programs. You learn to really understand the unity in diversity. All people are connected for food, so that's why we came up with the idea of creating the European Union House of Cuisine, um, as it doesn't yet exist. And those houses would be located in every member state of European Union and would be meant for people to try traditional foods uh, from all member states. The main idea is uh, getting culture out of its comfort zone. In this way of thinking, to take people to culture and take culture to people. In the end, we believe that Europe is some sort of cultural mosaic and we would like it to be both dynamic and democratic. This brings us to the very exciting part of voting. The vote is open. That brings us to the winners and winners in plural. Team number one, the opportunity of discovering other cultures through traveling. Team number eight, preserving the culture learned from the past and use it to build the future. Team number seven, experiment with culture. I was just so proud. I honestly, I almost cried when I heard yeah, that we too. were one. Prenez votre avenir en main. Nous, nous devons travailler avec vous. Nous devons construire cette Europe, votre Europe, avec vous.